We ran the Ministry for Healthy Kids program, which was a program specifically designed for teaching kids about healthy lifestyles, primarily focusing on engaging kids in being more physically active, as well as teaching them nu nutrition skills as well. I was nominated by Janelle Ponchak and Chris Ferg, who are my supervisor and my director in the clinic. And what was really unique about that is that Janelle's daughter actually got to be a part of our program as well. I like working with Jason and Chris because they're really funny and active and they help me with making better choices. So I'm grateful that ministry allows us the opportunity to not just not just lecture kids in the clinic, but also get to run a program like this, get to get out in the field, in the schools, in the community, and impact the community. We were nominated for the Living the Vision Award because we got to run a program geared specifically towards at-risk kids by BMI standards. So we focused on kids with a BMI over 95th percentile primarily to engage them in being more active. There's a gap out there for, for these kids and we wanted them to learn that it's fun to be active, um, good food, doesn't have to taste bad, it can taste good, you can make it, you can share the ideas with your family. We were doing what we thought was right and, and um, in a way that we thought it would help the kids and so we were, we were trying to really fill a gap not seeking any award or accolades, but hoping that this would then be able to expand. You know, I'm really hopeful that it becomes a little bit bigger, you know, that we're able to reach a lot of kids that maybe spend a lot of time at home and, and don't really know the benefits of getting out there and being active and being fit. It certainly made a big difference for my daughter. Um, you know, I just, I see a difference in the decisions that she makes with activity. I see, I see different choices in food. Jason and Chris put a lot of additional effort into coming up with something that could be proactive. Credit goes to a lot of people. I mean, not only Mark Mason, who brought the vegetables in, but my team who helped me sort those vegetables, get the recipes ready. With the help of Mark Mason, our lean leader here in the organization, Mark provided these families with fresh produce. And what was nice is that we also got to provide them with, with recipes as well of how to use these vegetables. You can spend a lot of time with day-to-day -day work, but you know, really when people go out and they they do something exceptional. I think it's worth recognizing and I think that this is a great opportunity to just say thank you for, for everything that they do to help make us a, um, you know, a, a medical home and you know, to really just be proactive in people's health. I think that that's what it's all about.